All right, something special is about to happen to Johnson County foster children. Martha Gershon is executive director of CASA. That's the Court Appointed Special Advocates, and that's in Jackson County, and she joins us now live. Thanks so much for being here. Thank you for having us. You know, first of all, we want to talk about you as a woman inspiring other women because, you know, this month we've been talking inspirational stories of women who are really at the top of their game, and you are in social services. So tell us, what would your advice be? What are your secrets to success? I think the most important thing for women in this sector or any sector to realize is that people want to do the right thing. Mm -hmm. I had a long corporate career, now my career in nonprofits with CASA. If you give people the opportunity to donate, to volunteer, to help others in our community, they'll do it. And so tell us what have you, what's driven you? What's the passion here with CASA and what drives you to keep helping these children who are in desperate need? On both sides of our state line in Missouri and Kansas, we have record numbers of children in foster care. That is not their fault. Mm -hmm. Something terrible happened to them. They were removed from their homes. It is our jobs, all of our jobs, to help take care of these children. And that's what CASA does. Our volunteers are the ones who help to find these kids a safe, permanent home. So at one point, you were named the Executive Director of the Year uh, for CASA. Tell us, you know, what that really meant for you. How do you stand high and above just doing the normal helping? I mean, It was a great honor yeah. to be named the Program Director of the Year for the state of Missouri. I think Jackson County on the Kansas City side mm -hmm. is a really important place to do this kind of work. We do it in Johnson County and Wyandotte counties too. Kids everywhere in our community, they need help. Well, oh, inspiring story. Thank you so much. Well, now let's talk about this wonderful things that's going to happen tomorrow for these kids, and it's all about toys. We're incredibly excited. The Toy Industry Foundation, in partnership with National CASA, has chosen Kansas City as one of only three markets to receive an extraordinary donation of toys. We already have over 5,000 toys. Wow. The volunteers are getting them ready today, and tomorrow we're going to give those toys to almost 500 foster children in our community. What is that going to mean to them? I mean, you've seen this happen on a, on a smaller level. This is just huge. What does that mean to the child, that single toy for that single child who's had so much harm and hurt in their heart? These are kids who often have nothing of their own. They may have been removed from their homes with just their clothes in a trash bag. Mm -hmm. To have a brand new, perfectly age-appropriate toy handed to them no questions asked. This is yours. You own it now. It means the world to these kids. So do you see the smiles, even though they've had this big trauma happen in their lives that's just taken them out of a home? I mean, it's really traumatizing. So is there a smile? Is this just a moment for them to just be a kid? Absolutely. Children are resilient, and they will give you back goodwill if you show it to them in return. So what the Toy Industry Foundation is allowing us to do is show these children there are adults who care and good things can happen to you. So what do we need to do? Are there, is there anything that we need to do in terms of, of helping CASA in its mission to help children or with the toy drive? We need help with volunteers. CASAKC.org, that's our website. We are looking for more than 200 people this year to become new CASA volunteers, to be matched one-on-one -on -one with these children, to help keep them safe. If someone goes to the website and calls our phone numbers, we'll tell them everything they need to know. Gosh, that's great. And with all your words of inspiration about we should be involved in social services, that's part of being a success in life is to help others. So sure. hopefully people will, you know, jump on that website and we'll have it on ours a little bit later so that yeah, we can make it easier for you to jump in and join CASA in their initiative to help children. Thank you so much. It means a lot. And good luck for the toy drive. We're going to be covering that tomorrow. Thanks. Yeah, we're excited to have you there, and you can take home a toy if you want. <laughs> oh, no. Let's leave it all for the kids. Thanks so much, Martha. Thank you.